Hey everybody, Brother Echo here with Annie Peel. How you doing, Annie? I'm awesome. All right. Good to see you. You too. It's been a while. <laughs> I know it has. Mm -hmm. It's been too long. Mm -hmm. We're here in uh, Los Angeles at the Test Kitchen, uh, which is a new spot that is doing a lot of really cool stuff in the area. Maybe Annie, you can tell us a little bit about what's going on next week. Next, this week, this, this coming week. week on Wednesday and Thursday, we are presenting raw in a whole new way. I'm inspired by molecular gastronomy, which, as we know, um, it's just about sort of presenting uh, cuisine in, in pro processed in a new way, like right. in a new way, right? right? But a lot of times, it comes from um, manufacturing chemicals that are used to create different textures. Mm. So I'm really inspired to present raw food in a new way to mm -hmm. all the foodies out there right. without any of the chemicals. So coming back to mother nature. So instead of using like, you know, sodium alginate, which mm -hmm. comes from, or carrageenan, which is a derivative of kelp and, and sea vegetables, mm -hmm. we just use Irish sea moss. It seems like we might be ready to take a diff an evolution here in LA as far as our dining experience with living foods. Exactly. And I think that um, I'm hoping that in the way that I'm presenting raw food, it's never been presented yet before. Because yeah. I think that in the last like, you know, 10 or 15 years, we've Sort of been in similar place there's mm -hmm. so many great raw food restaurants and cafes we're oh, yeah. so lucky we have a ton of them in la there's some in new york they're all over the country right but i think that the way that um, i'm going to be presenting it is going to be a little bit different so mm -hmm. I, I feel like it's like the new raw food 3.0 okay and i call, right. it, I call <laughs> our raw food now 2.0 yeah yeah 1.0 was like the functional <laughs> right but i think this is like the new intro to raw 3.0 okay so i'm really excited are you guys ready for your upgrade that's all i'm saying <laughs> yeah so what what are some of the highlights maybe if you can pick three dishes that people are really going to be turned on to this week. Oh my gosh, how do I even? <laughs> I love desserts, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to be doing like a flourless, I think what we're going to call it is a chocolate cookie dough, but it's mm. going to be a lava cake, okay. chocolate cookie dough lava cake. So it's going to be like a flourless cake texture mm -hmm. with walnuts and chocolate, uh, raw cacao, of mm. course our delicious big tree farms cacao, yeah. and, um, and then we're going to press that into a mold and then fill it with a, a fudge sauce, mm -hmm. and the fudge will be served warm, so when you cut into it's like a molten lava cake oh. and then that will be dressed with um so i will be using like freeze drying so mm -hmm. i have some freeze dried cherries Ooh, wow. so i'll be garnished with that and we're going to be doing um let's see a pumpkin pie with lacuma yacon ice cream like a, a polenta mm -hmm. of a uh, corn polenta with like wild mushroom ragu mm -hmm. And we're gonna be doing like a micro salad with flowers, and mm. I'm gonna be doing a stuffed Anaheim. This is more. This is the fourth one. So stuffed Anaheim chili peppers. <laughs> yeah, let's see. I think we got them yeah, rocking back here. Going here. <laughs> <I'm going> here. <laughs> That's gonna be stuffed, actually. Um, Alex Resnick, top chef from Bravo, he actually um, smoked, cold smoked my cashews for mm, me. Right. So in raw foods, we can never have that smoky flavor. Right. Right. So for the first time, we're going to be having smoke. And right. so also with the mushrooms, I'm going to be infusing them with the vacuum mm -hmm. to push the flavor of Lapsang Shushang tea through the mushrooms. So Lapsang Shushang yes. tea. Yes. Do you know what that is? No. <laughs> smoked tea. Okay. So I'm brewing the tea, so that part is cooked, but I'm going to be marinating the vegetables in that. I'm going to oh. be using a vacuuming. Uh, apparatus, it right. like blows it up, pulls all the air out, it pushes whatever <laughs> sauce you put in there. So it's compressing the mushrooms. Wow. So be compressing the smoked tea into the mushrooms. So the mushrooms are still wow. raw. It's right. just that the smoked flavor of the tea will be pressed. They're into being it. Infused, infused with some goodness. Yeah. So we've wow. never been able to have smoked. So right. Two dishes will have smoked flavor. Okay. You guys, like this is seriously next level right here. <laughs> so excited. So excited. Um, well, why don't we do this? I, we have this big space here and everybody's doing this food prep. Maybe we can walk around and I tasted some of those cashews back there, the smoked cashews. And I'm already in love with Big Tree Farms cashews because the flavors, but now I don't know what you did to them, but maybe we can show the people <laughs> what's up. Yeah, totally. Okay. We can interview Alex, tell him what. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So this is Chef Alex Resnick. How you doing? <laughs> if you recognize him, he's from Bravo Top Chef. He actually cold smoked the cashews for us, our beautiful hand shelled uh, Indonesian uh, Big Tree Farms cashews. He cold smoked them. So do you want to talk to us about how you did that? Sure. I mean, it's a, it's a pretty simple format. Basically, there's this little device called the smoking gun. And basically what you do is you load it with either hickory chips or applewood chips. We use a combination of both. And what you do is you kind of light that and there's a little fan that pulls it through a little tube. And then you can smoke anything you want. Just cover it with a little plastic wrap. And just the length of time, that's it. It's a real, real simple process. Nice. Yeah. Let's go check it out. So this is our hotel pan. Yeah. Yeah. Delicious. Perfect. Yeah, you totally smell it. Mm -hmm. You smell the smoke. Yeah, I totally taste and then we're gonna smoke. Do, and then we got the smoked cheese, right? 
Now, and we're gonna use this to make the cheese that's gonna stuff our Anaheim chili peppers and it's gonna give a, that aroma of smoked. And Is that taste smoked cheese? Smoke. Yum. Right. So Doreen, Doreen nice Fong. Thing. This is our next Food Network star, Doreen Fong. <laughs> so let's try the smoked cheese. All right. Alex? I'm in. Mmm, my God! <laughs> wow, that flavor just carries over yep. amazingly Smooth, well. Smoky, nice and garlicky. Wow. Delicious. And a little bit of lemon. It totally tastes like hickory. It's really good. It's oh, excellent. wow, that is incredible! So one of the first pieces of equipment that set up our kitchen was a bank of eight dehydrators sent over by Excalibur, my favorite dehydrator company. I love them. Check them out. They're full of kale chips. So these are my cheddar kale chips. They're made with red bell pepper, cashews, Big Tree Farms again, of course, my fave, and a little bit of olive oil and agave. And then we're dehydrating these. And I love, if you get a, a dehydrator, I would say nine tray with the timer built in. I just love that. So this is gonna go with a truffle cheese that is gonna have caviar on it. I'm still working out the caviar details, but it, we will have caviar. So this is made out of um, brown, black meal, sunflower seeds, black sesame seeds, and they're really delicious. So that is what we've been making. And you can see we have our lapsang shishan going. This is what's going to, the tea that's going to be infusing our, our mushrooms, our wild mushrooms, and all of our beautiful Earth Circle organic ingredients from acai powder to virgin hemp oil to cold pressed olive oil. All right, you guys, this Wednesday and Thursday here at the Test Kitchen in Los Angeles, it's going to be awesome. Everyone in the raw sangha, we need to be here. Annie, let's close this out. All right. So, yeah, definitely join us down here on Wednesday and Thursday. Come down and find Alex Resnick, top chef and Doreen Fong, next Food Network star. They're gonna be in the kitchen serving it up, raw style. And it's on this Wednesday and this Thursday, so you definitely want to RSVP with the restaurant, Test Kitchen. They have a website, testkitchenla.com. Um, or you can, I think, RSVP on Open Table. And thank you to Big Tree Farms for all of the great ingredients that are fueling our food, all of our superfoods. And Earth Circle Organics, we love you! We love you! <laughs> Peace, everybody.